Hello there, and welcome back to the Inherited Mansion Challenge. Okay, so Rory is just currently cleaning the floor a bit, because obviously it's a, a big, big mess. Uh, why is it taking so long? Ooh, there we go. It's all gone, right? Yeah, I think the floor is all cleaned up. Nice. Okay, let's come down and have some food. I think we still have a bit of that pork. Oops, not that. I think we still have some of that pork left. Oh, he's coming to eat already. So I don't have to do it myself. Here we go. Um, So it just, you know, before I started filming, I made him paint a couple of other like basic paintings. As you can see, the money hasn't gone up by much. I think it was probably about 300 simoleons. Uh, and we sold them to a collector. So that's that milestone then as well. Obviously, we still have to do some emotional paintings. We're going to look for some odd jobs, but we do have a bit of money. So I'm thinking that soon, maybe today, we'll start doing either the bedroom or or the downstairs area. I'm not sure which one we're going to do first. I feel like the bedroom would be a good idea just so we could get a better bed. And yeah, because then it would just rest a lot faster, you know. I think that that's a good idea. I had him do a few more paintings as well, so that we can sell those at some point today. Come on, man, are you done? Okay, can you wash that, please? It doesn't take that much work to do that. Go on, Mary, go on. Okay, and I think I'm gonna have him come out here. I sold his bike, by the way, because uh, I, I got tired of him walking everywhere. Not walking everywhere, but, you know, just getting on his bike for no reason. So let's have a quick look. Oh, he's also reached level two of the, the entrepreneur, entrepreneur skill. I don't know if it was entrepreneurial skill, but entrepreneur skill. And that means that he can now... Okay, I'll get back to that in a second. Oh, this is a good one. But we can't get that because our handiness is not that high. Absolutely not. So I guess... What's this? Um, no, I, I mean, I guess we could try to do this cave one because that's quite a lot of money. So we could try to do that. Um, this would have been pretty cool, but we're just missing a level for the private diving lesson. So yeah, so we can now, what does it say? Promote our hustle um, by advertising it online. So that's, you know, a cute thing that we can do now. Let's quickly go to Sulani and see if we can explore this cave and get something good out of it. Okay, here we are. So let's quickly go here. I'm assuming he'll swim. Can we jog? If he jogs, does that mean that he... Yeah, he's definitely going to go for a little swim. But it's all right. We got our fitness up a bit, which is always good. So we can hopefully be able to do a few more odd jobs that require a higher fitness skill and we can go and explore this let's see how he does because what do i need to find we need to find some kind of treasure and then mail it okay hopefully it's something good uh as rory passed over the cavern with a flashlight he spotted something i'm gonna go have him explore again while we're reading this and the rocks above, and decided to scale the slippery stone walls to have a look, though he made quick work getting up the wall. Just as he reached for the object he spotted from below, Rory's leg slipped and he tumbled to the ground below. Luckily, he didn't break anything, well, except for maybe his pride. Well, that's a shame, but at least he didn't break anything, like they said. He wants to chat with, uh, Mike? Mike? <laughs> I assume that's how you'd say that name? Mike has... Interesting. Okay. Oh. Kind of the same thing again. Oh, we got something, though. Okay, we now have treasure, so we can mail that. Okay, so it wasn't the same. Let me read that again while he quickly chats with Mike. Um, taking his time and catching himself after, after a few missteps, where he was able to claim the out-of-reach object. Sick. So this is worth what? 425. Okay, I guess we still make a little bit more money than what it's worth. So that's good. That didn't even count. That didn't even count. How disappointing is that? Let's clean this trash up, I guess. And can we scuba dive in any of the ones here? We can, right? Is it only in the one that's like 
on the other side of the beach. Yeah, it probably is, isn't it? It's gonna be this one. Yeah, free dive. Wait, why can't we... This one says free dive, but then the other one says scuba dive. So which one is it, Mary? So scuba dive, too shallow. Okay, and then the other one just says whatever it is. What does it say? Free dive. I guess we'll do that anyway. Oh, it's a little pineapple plant. Oh, it's still growing. Okay. Otherwise, we were going to grab a little... Just snatch a pineapple, you know. Why not? Okay, let's see if he can get anything good. There's a lot of, like, colorful fish here. Like, look at all those fish. This is just so that you can, like, catch pretty much every kind of fish here. Hmm. Maybe. But we don't have much of a fishing skill, do we? We don't have any fishing skill. So it's not like we can do anything about it realistically. Let's see how he does. Oh, okay. He's back. And I'm assuming he got nothing out of it. Slimed. Nice. Okay, let's go back home then. Oh, what does he want? Oh, okay. Congratulations. Um, yeah, we're going to go back home so we can mail this treasure and then maybe do another job. Or just go somewhere and do uh, a little yard sale. Maybe you could just sell it uh, uh, out the house. Oh, Jordan's... Okay, what does Jordan want? Go on a date to the lounge. Okay, sure, why not? I mean, I don't know that that lounge is exactly the best place for us to go to, but anyway, sure. Guess we're not going home after all now, are we? <laughs> but anyway. Oh my god, look at them having uh, matching... Oh, they're not matching sliders, but they're both wearing sliders. And, oh, okay, he's quite clearly into men, I guess. Uh, maybe let's uh, give him a comp... Okay, I got. I thought we were going to just, you know, just say that we like his outfit, but apparently we cannot do that. Um, let's ask him about his day. I know it's small talk and not all sims like small talk, but I feel like we should, you know, just ask him how he's doing, you know. Give him a little hug. And a kiss, I guess. Like, if you went on a date with someone that you already kissed and didn't kiss him first thing, then that would be a bit strange, wouldn't it? Let's compliment his appearance. There you go. And ask him if he's single. Because I don't think we got an announcer to that last time, did we? Okay, we did. Never mind. I'm just confused. Ooh, just call me Cupid for hooking up other sims. Oh, that's from... Right. Yeah, I'm not really interested. Oh, we can't even go in here. Because of this. Oh, damn it. What's the point of that? Why did you bring us here? Is it to go look at the stars? Is that why we came here? Oh. We should deface one of these. Judith. Let's deface Judith. Yes, let's quickly do that while we're here. He is an artist after all, so he would definitely do something like this. Okay, Jordan, what should we do? Let's see, what is there around here that we can do? Is there a place we can sit? Is there anything interesting that we can look at? I don't think so. Unfortunately. Oh, there's a little bench here. We can come and sit here. Alright, there they go. So, I guess let's just... Be flattering to him. Maybe gossip about our neighbors. Uh, and, like, ask him about his interests, I guess? What can we do? Oh, should we talk about dogs? Of course. We love dogs. And uh, discuss fitness techniques. Maybe ask him... Can we say anything about painting other than... I guess just discuss color theory. I guess see if that does anything. We can ask him about his attractive preferences and see what he says, you know? What is this? He wants to listen to music. Well, you're not going to actually go in the lounge, sweetie. So, unfortunately, yeah, we can't really do much. He's not feeling very well. Okay, how can we make you feel better? Um, Maybe a flirtatious joke would make you feel a little bit better. We already complimented your appearance. <gasps> oh, no, we didn't sell it. Oh, my God, I'm such an idiot. Why do I have a scorpion fish? Well, I guess we still made the money. Oh my god, I, I'm, okay, well, that was a bit foolish, wasn't it? Oh well, it's fine. Once we're done with the date, um, we're gonna go, he likes the white blonde hair color. Is that our hair color? 
I guess so. Okay, we really need to go pee, so we're going to end this date here. Let's give him a hug. Let's embrace him. And end this date. I right, so know we still have a lot of time left, but we just gotta go. Because we have many, many things to do. He's our first friend as well, I think. Like, out of all these people, I'm pretty sure he's our first friend, which is absolutely ridiculous. What are you- Oh no, we got bills. 13,000. 13,000. How are we gonna have money for this? We're definitely not- I, I don't know how we're gonna do this. We're not gonna be able to pay. The repo man is definitely coming and taking our stuff. We just gotta make sure that I that I keep the easel like on us so that that doesn't get stolen, you know? I think that's what we're gonna have to do. Okay, let's um, do that right now and maybe have um, some applesauce, I guess. That's nice. That's a nice thing to have, I guess. What do we get? Promote creative arts. Okay, that's good. That's always a good thing to get. Let's clean that up. And let's... Maybe we should just come out here and do a little... And do our little uh, yard sale. All right. Oh, that's not great placement. Now, is it? Okay, apparently it's what we're going to get. So stock table, ten table, and start a yard sale. Hopefully, people will come around and want to buy. Oh, there's someone here. Is this that same person with the blue hair? Yes, it's him again. Hello, sir. How you doing? Please buy one of our... Oh, Greg. Greg, what are you doing here? You lost, girl. Are you lost? This is not the place for you to be. <laughs> okay, bye, Greg. Who is that? Who are you, sir? I'm I'm not even gonna try. He's very pretty. Very pretty. We should probably say hello to him. Wait, don't go! Hello, how are you? Oh, why did that go up to little hearts? Uh, maybe let's ask him about his day. Uh, thank you so much for buying a painting. So we discuss, discuss color theory. Uh, we should probably try to actually sell stuff. And speak to these people and give them little sale pitches. Please buy one of our paintings. Our charisma skill went up, which is great. We definitely like that. Okay, she's gone. Can we try to give you a sales pitch? Please. Yes. Oh, that was Jeffrey. Of course, Jeffrey bought one. Of course, Jeffrey bought one. Anyone else wants to buy another one? Oh, we perceive him as basic looking. Okay. What about Lily? Just not interested at all. Okay. Oh, hello, sir. You want to buy this painting? Go on. Yes! Okay, that's the end of that. Thank you. No, just put it back in our inventory. All right, guys. He's just going to go to sleep now. And I'll see you all in the morning. All right, everyone. We're back. And we have just completely demolished this toilet and also broken the sink isn't that great but at least we've had a bath which is good we got that done uh it just needs to eat a bit of food this looks so gross honestly i'm thinking no i'm not gonna do that i was gonna fix the the kitchen but i'm actually not because let's be real the repo man's gonna come and take this stuff it, with our luck they're literally going to come in and take whatever we have here that we need, you know? Instead of, I don't know, coming somewhere around here and taking uh, the microwave or something. Like, just take that, you know? Instead of... I know that's still... How much stuff are they actually going to take? We have our bills in our inventory and we're just, like, looking at it like, Jesus, how are we going to do this? So that's definitely going to be a bit of a challenge. So let's see... Um, our odd jobs and what we could potentially try to do today. Oh, this is that um, uh, thingy. Uh, what is it called? <laughs> Scuba diving uh, thing. Okay, we're definitely going to try and do that. And definitely the beach cleaning uh, work as well. So we're going to take both of those. So we need to dive for treasure anywhere specific? No. And then mail it. All right. So yeah, let's go do that. 
Did, wait, did we take both jobs or just the one? Can we only take one at a time? Yeah. Okay, fine. Go away. Oh, we should probably change our phone case and stuff as well. In fact, that's something... What color would you have, Rory? Um, not brown. That's ugly. Not pink. Is that like a burgundy? I feel like burgundy is a very you color. Even the green is nice, but... Ooh, this is a nice color. Yeah, that's a nice background color. And then for his phone case... Perhaps this? Is it? Is he gonna show it off? Oh, that's not very nice. Kinda looks, oh, uh, it's fine. Yeah, that'll do. It kinda looks like a candy bar, a chocolate bar. But yeah, let's quickly go to Sulani, go scuba dive a bit more and get try to get some treasure and make some money. And this time, can't forget to actually sell it. Okay, here we are at the beach. We're going to have him swim over there to the buoy or boy, whatever, however you say it, wherever you're from. And we're going to have him free dive. That's why we couldn't scuba dive, because we need to get um, a rebreather to actually scuba dive. That's what it is. So at least now we know. Uh, now I know anyway. I'm sure that a lot of you knew that and how that works. So let's dive for treasure and see if we get anything good. Oh, Jordan, Jordan's calling us, asking us to go to GeekCon. I'm really sorry, but we can't go to GeekCon. At least not now. It's a bit early, and we got things to do. Otherwise, it would it would have been a lovely day with you. Oh, look how blue it looks now. It looks a bit less greeny blue and just like regular blue. Maybe it's just because of the sky. Oh, we have to actually dive for treasure. No. Okay, fine. We just you wasted a bunch of money. Go on. I guess at least we'll be able to find some treasure, you know? Hopefully, anyway. Oh, he found a fabulous treasure, which turned out to be an ordinary rock. Well, that's a bit of a waste. Okay, anything? Yes, he found the heart of Sulani. How much is that worth? 425. Okay, can we... What time are we supposed to finish it? By 6 p.m. Okay, can we try another one? Just see if we can get another one and sell that as well. You know, just to make a bit more money, because for all the money that we just lost. Ooh, now we're level four, so we can pro if we ever see that job again for like private uh, diving lessons, we can do that. Ooh, and we found another heart of Sulani. Oh, maybe it's, it's the only thing we can find, just so that we don't find anything like super expensive and sell it for less. Okay, yeah, that's cool. Um, let's just go back home now. Um, why is he going? Okay, a bit strange. Yeah, just go here, I guess. Yeah, we're going to go home and sell this before time runs out. All right, and we're back home. So let's make sure that we mail this. Um, how does one... Does it matter? Ooh, this one for sure. How do we do it? Mail treasure. Click on a mailbox. Okay. Ooh, don't do that, please. Uh, mail treasure. We're definitely going to do this one because it's worth a lot less money. So let's do that. Get our 600 and whatever simoleons. 658, nice. And let's sell this as well. So we get 810. Yes, that's what we need to do. So at least we made up the money that we lost by a little bit, I guess. Um, I guess he should eat, but we can't be eat, continue eating just like, n n you know, just not good meals. Let's try to see if there's another job that we could take. Anything good that we could do with the skills that we have? I guess there's a, a fitness level two job. What about this charisma one? What charisma skill are we at? Level two, so we definitely cannot do that. Yeah, let's try and do this. Um, this fitness, what was it? It was a boot. Hiking buddy. Okay, someone wants someone to hike with. Fine, we'll definitely do that. We have almost an hour for that. So let's quickly have a bit of food, I guess. We'll have some... What should we have? Peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Why not? Let's just have that. Let's be basic. Please do your dishes. Be a responsible adult. Oh, he has to go to his... Okay, he's going... Is he going? Oh, here's... He wants to become best friends. Yeah, sure, Jordan. Uh, can we please go to work? Go do your odd job, please. 
Okay, I guess we're best friends now, even though our friendship is not that high. And we've only known each other for a day. I think they need to, like, tone that down for sure. Because that's a bit insane, you know? Oh, no. 24 hours to pay our bills. Oh, goodness. Oh, before our water shut off. So I guess we probably still have a bit more time before the repo man comes. I guess we'll have to wait and find out. And that went really well. We made some extra money as well, which is good. We got a little tip. All right. Yeah, we no longer have power. Great. Lovely. So that means we can't cook. Yeah, because we don't have... Oh. Oh, I mean, maybe this is where we should start going the eco lifestyle, you know, way so that we don't have to... It's kind of like a off the grid moment, you know? So it's like, yeah, obviously we have this huge mansion, but if we have enough to just like power up whatever little things we're using at the moment, why not? And he's a maker, so he would probably be into this, I think, because a fabricator. Maybe he would, maybe he wouldn't. Who actually knows what he would be into? Should we, just for, you know, the sake of it, go on a date with someone? Should we do, let's just do a, let's do a female blind date this time and try it out. Okay, so here we are. Ooh, she's cute. Alice. Her name is Alice. Are you looking for Wonderland? Let's do a little friendly Alice, introduction. Cool. Hello, Alice. How are you? Uh, I guess we can ask her about her day. Uh, get to know her a little bit. I, this is just, I guess, normal things. Like, what do you do for work? Um, I don't think Jordan will be very happy about this. Maybe we will enthuse about fashion for a little bit, just to... Why not? And then... Mm, I guess... Compliment her appearance, if we mean it. Do we? Ooh, what is that? Oh, alien night. Ooh, maybe we should date an alien. Why is he? Why is she feeling embarrassed? Good compatibility. That's good. Okay, let's have a look and see. Basic looking. Oh, he's not that attracted to her. Okay. Well, I mean, it is what it is. It's not like it's, you know, there's nothing wrong with it. Let's have a look and see if there's anyone around that he finds attractive then. Anyone at all? He hasn't noticed anyone. Love it. <laughs> so, so far we've seen, we've found like two or three people attractive. Of course, let's go meet this alien just because why not? You know, it's alien night. Um, Maybe we should just stay friends, you know? Let's just do that. Like, can we, can we stop talking to her? And I'm trying to meet this alien. Like, I know we came here on a date with you. But, I mean... Hello. Alonzo. How are you? It's definitely cool, you know? For someone, I guess. And if this was, like, a real-life situation, imagine if we actually saw... Oh, she's... That was a bit strange. Maybe let's flirt with her. Let's just get these things done. Um, just so we can get, like, get him happy that he went on a date and everything. We can ask her if she's single. We can do all that stuff. All the normal stuff. Maybe even give her a kiss. Uh, let's just have the two of them sit together somewhere else so that we're not on top of everyone, you know? Can we sit somewhere else? No. Uh, I guess we could sit out here. It's probably cold. Yeah, it is very cold. But let's just come and sit here. Because this way, we're, no one will be, like, uncomfortable or anything. We'll just be... Oh, come on and sit, girl. Stop it. What's what's wrong? Can you not come here? Can you not walk over here? See? You can sit. All right, so let's flirt again. Do a little pickup line. Um, and once he's, like... I guess you could just invite her over, try to have some fun, and then be like, Yeah, I don't know. You know, maybe, I don't think it worked out for me. I just don't, you know, I guess I just don't feel that way about you. I guess that's something you could do. Snuggle. That'd be cute. And then, should we try to give her a kiss now? Do we think that can happen? First kiss. Let's have him give a kiss. There you go. Like, uh, do you want to, like, come back to mine? Or is that a little... Is there... One of these bushes... Oh, we can't do it yet. Okay, I guess we gotta get our 
relationship up a little bit more. So I guess we'll kiss our hands. We'll hold our hands. Maybe embrace even just to get this up. He wants to joke, but I mean, he doesn't want. Oh, okay, there we go. Woohoo with Atlas. Let's go and do that. Oh, okay. Is she interested in him? I guess she is. Otherwise, she wouldn't have said yes to it, right? I'm assuming so. There they go. Okay, he used the condom. Good. I was going to say, did he, did he or did he not? All right, let's just clear this. There they go. Having some fun. And I guess tomorrow we'll just be like, so, yeah, maybe we're just not... I think we should just be friends, you know? Anyone you're attracted to in here now? Nope. Okay, let's go home then. All right, everyone, we're back home. Uh, he's obviously just going to go to sleep and get his energy up. Um, I think that I'm going to cut here. And ne the next day, I'm just going to have him do loads and loads and loads of paintings. And then we're just going to try and sell those so we can make as much money as we possibly can. Because obviously we're going to need it. Because I don't know what's going to happen. I don't know if the repo man's going to come and take our stuff um, or what. But I really wanted to get at least one of the floors done in this part. So I'm going to make sure and do that. Uh, I'll cut here. And when I come back, we should hopefully be somewhere selling our paintings to make enough money to remodel one of our floors. So see you all in a second. Okay, everyone, we are back. And here we go. We have just stocked up the table. So let's have him tend to the table, mark up the prices to maybe 75 just so we can make a bit more money and start a street sale. So this one's actually a masterpiece. I don't know what that accent was. A uh, masterpiece. <laughs> uh, but uh, yeah, two of these are normal, three of them are excellent, and we have a few more in our inventory. So hopefully we'll get some people coming here so we can make some money. As you can see, it's a harvest fest. I actually just had him go to the gym because we don't have any water. So I had him come to the gym to shower and I realized there was a kitchen. So I thought I'll just get in there, make a grand meal. Then he has it on him as well. So how many hours do we have left? Five hours. I mean, we can't really do anything with it, but... You know, because we can't put it in the fridge. Oh, and there we go. We just sold one. Uh, let's mark this up to 100%. If we're selling so quickly, let's just, you know, let's just put it a bit higher. Also, he bought the normal one out of everything. He bought the, like, the cheap, the, like, one of the most basic ones he could get. Hmm. You're basic. Maybe it was the cheapest one. That's probably why. I don't know. Okay, we have a few more people here. Let's give them our sales pitch. Oh, she already bought something. Nice, nice. Who else is coming? Come on, people. Come get your paintings. Come get your illustrations. No one wants the masterpiece. Is it because it's too expensive? Oh, there we go. We sold the masterpiece. We're making money. Yay. Okay, is anyone else coming? Even if the street sale ends, I'm still gonna, you know, start another one. You look like someone who would probably be like s buying like well you would be selling fake paintings somewhere wouldn't you sir let's talk the table up as well there we go now we have the rest of the paintings someone come and buy this please you definitely have money let's give you your, our sales pitch just because you know just to get that going oh hello another repeat customer come on oh no 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 Okay, he really just had to go use the bathroom. Let's come in here and tend this. We definitely would have sold one to George Langrab or whatever his name is. Hello, um, Lavina. Do you want to buy one? Yes. Oh, 3000 Why did that sell for so much money? Wow. Hello, you were here earlier and you didn't buy anything. Do you want something now, Erica? Oh, hello. You, you bought something before. You definitely should buy another one again. Please don't end before anyone actually buys stuff. There we go. Someone bought something. Was it Judith? We almost have... Oh, hey. You want another one? And our charisma skill is going up as well from doing this, which is always good because we could use that for odd jobs. We almost have enough money for our bills. That's insane. But at the same time, it's like, do I want to pay bills or do I want to uh, renovate the house? You know? I really want to renovate the house and see if they're... Repo man can just come and grab whatever. 
random thing I don't want, you know? Because that would be nice. Okay, fine. We'll stop that. And we'll go home. Let's put this in our inventory. Let's clear the table. Today, Mary. We've already stopped it, so we all need to go away. Yeah, let's just go home now. I guess something else we can do is list these on Plopsy and see if we can sell them there. You know, that's always a thing we can do. Yeah, I guess we could try to do that instead of just like selling them to collectors, you know? Um, no offers yet. Is there a way that we can try to... I don't know, probably not. I don't even know how much money they're selling for. Probably just for whatever value. Oh, it's rotten already, so I can't even eat it. Well, that's fine. He's not too, too hungry. Well, I guess we're not going to do the renovation yet. I'm really sorry. Um, I know I, I wanted to do that, but I'm just terrified that as soon as I do it, the repo man's going to come and take our stuff. I promise you that next one, we will definitely have a renovation of possibly even this whole... Uh, what is this area called? Of the whole carriage house. So, yeah. That's the plan. We'll definitely do it in the next part. So, thank you all so much for watching. Thank you so, so much for all your lovely comments and for enjoying. Uh, see you on the next one. Bye-bye.